Hi I'm Tom and today I'm going to talk about azathioprine and the importance of blood monitoring in relation to taking it. Azathioprine is a type of medicine called an immunosuppressant. Immunosuppressants help calm or control your body's immune system. This medicine helps treat inflammatory conditions such as rheumatoid arthritis, Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis, severe inflammation of the liver, skin or arteries and some blood disorders. If you have had a transplant, taking azathioprine can prevent your body from rejecting your new organ. Azathioprine is sometimes used to treat conditions that affect the skin. Azathioprine is available on prescription only. You will usually be prescribed this medicine by a specialist doctor. It comes as tablets. It is also available as an injection, but it is usually only given in hospital. You'll have regular blood tests before and during your treatment. Taking azathioprine can sometimes affect your liver, kidneys or bone marrow and you will have blood tests to check your liver function, kidney function and blood count before you start taking this medicine. From week 1 to week 8 of your treatment you will have blood tests every week. This is particularly important if you are taking a high dose or you have kidney or liver problems. From week 9 onwards you will have blood tests but less often. Your doctor will decide how often you need them. You may only need them every few months. It's important to have ongoing monitoring for as long as you are taking this medicine. Please ensure that you attend any blood monitoring appointments that are put in place for you so that any potential complications can be flagged up as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, please like, share and subscribe for more from Health Friendly. Thank you.